General Walker, officers and men of the 36th Division, I get a big kick out of being here this afternoon in order to present decorations to members of this division who have distinguished themselves on the field of battle. This is an especial occasion this afternoon for not only do I give approximately 140 decorations, but one to be decorated is Sergeant Kelly, who has been awarded the Medal of Honor by our government, the highest decoration to be given by the United States government. Citation. Given by the division. To those men who have given their lives in order that we of the Fifth Army could carry on. And in order that we of the Fifth Army, after this war has been brought to a successful conclusion, may return home to our loved ones and our homes and find them safe and undamaged by the ravages of war. I know of the successes at Salerno and your later battles, and they have followed you to the Rapido and then later to your last effort in the high ground behind Casino. The whole nation is proud of you, and so is the Fifth Army. Now to say a few words to those of you who are to be decorated. This rugged terrain, which you know only too well, for you have been there. The weather has been bad. Rain and snow and cold. Yet the Fifth Army has gone ahead thanks to you. Sergeant moved out. Sergeant Kelly was observed deliberately loading and firing a rocket launcher from the window. He was successful in covering the withdrawal of the unit and later in joining his own organization. Sergeant Kelly's fighting determination and intrepidity in battle exemplify the highest traditions of the armed forces of the United States. Entered the service from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania by command of Lieutenant General Devers, David G. Barr, Brigadier General G.S.C., Chief of Staff, official. Center. I am one of the proudest men in the Army because I got this Congressional Medal of Honor. But I never got this Congressional Medal of Honor if it wasn't for me and my buddies. My buddies stuck beside me, them in the 36th Division. I don't have much to say, but thanks to all of them, living and dead. But I hope that my mother could see me now. That's all I got to say. I am the proudest man in the Army today because I received the Congressional Medal of Honor. If it wasn't for my buddies and the rest of the 36th Division, I would have never received this Congressional. But there's only one thing wrong. I would like to see my mother today. Well, I'm stuck. I wish my mother was here to share my joys with me today. Stop. Uh, 